Hey guys, Jim Viscardi here. We are talking Sherlock today, and I am super excited because it was funny. I was just talking to uh, Stephen and Mark, and they had mentioned, I had asked them when you found out what your big twist was last season. They told me it wasn't until you read the script. What was that, what was that experience like for you? Was it a total shock for you, or did you start to see things coming? I didn't see that coming, no. <laughs> I was, I was, we, Martin and I were sitting in our front room, in our living room, because uh, we always read the scripts together mm -hmm. uh, when we get them. And when we got to the part where she shoots Sherlock, we just looked at each other and I said, oh my God, this is just, this is amazing. This is just, it's such a huge twist. Mm -hmm. And you totally don't see it coming. Um, and I knew that there'd be quite a few fans that would hate me, which is great, because that's what you're supposed to, you know, that's what we do. We, we make characters that you love and hate. Um, but it was, it was such, it was what it was. It was lovely to read that and know, oh, I've got to play that. That'd be great. I have to play this assassin, this, this kind of hard-nosed, really scary assassin who seems quite mild-mannered. And actually, at that point, during that time, there'd been a report in the news of a Russian woman who was a mum to about four people, four kids, and uh, mild mannered as you like, woman next door, nobody knew that who she, she was a trained assassin and she had mm -hmm. been for years and years. So I thought, oh, it does happen, it can happen. Mm -hmm. it, was, it was quite serendipitous that that story came out just prior to me or just after I'd read that episode. But also there's a t there is a time when the scripts are being done that quite often they go out to like the art department before they go to the actors yeah. because the actors won't get it until it's had like the dialogue polish mm -hmm. as well. And uh, I remember actually, I think it was episode three recently, we sent out to, I think it's Ben and Martin. You know. yeah. And then we walk, we walk around like that going, has anyone said anything? Have they read it? Has anyone said anything? <laughs> and nobody said anything to us about two days. So in the end, I went up to Martin and I said, did you read the script? And he went, no, have you sent it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And he just, hadn't he just hadn't opened it. Oh, he said, oh, I thought it was a cool sheet. I hadn't opened yeah. it. <laughs> For for you, how is I mean, how is important how important is it for, you know, on the proof side of things for, you know, someone like her to have that sort of genuine uh, surprise and is that is that something that you guys, you know, methodically plan it is, out? Because also it's that is the audience as well. Um, I mean quite often I get I get delivered scripts by the boys in chunks. Um, <laughs> So, I, probably because they haven't finished it, but they say it so I can get the cliffhanger moment. Uh, but that's how we can work. It, otherwise, if they know everything that's going to go on, you start second guessing what's actually happening. Whereas I think if you can read it first time as a viewer, yeah. then that's when it and works. And that's how you do when you read it first time. You absolutely read it as the viewer and how they'll react. And it's, but you, in, in I the, try and read it as a viewer, yeah, whereas my other bit of my head's going, this, can't afford that, can't afford that. <laughs> yeah, not that not <laughs> what do you mean by that? That's another but, helicopter. But isn't it that it, in the third, this, this fourth series, that every time you read, I can't remember which episode it was, just crying, just crying. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I know. So, so, there, so there's a lot of crying this season, is oh, that what? I, well, I cried a you lot cry, for some yeah. reason. I do cry But, a but that's juxtaposed with, with humour, as, yeah. as it should be, because all great dramas should have comedy in it as well, because that's life. So can we expect uh, Mary to get her hands a bit dirtier this season? Uh, she, well, she she continues. She continues. You work you in that mud. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I can't say yeah, she, but she she's she lives up to her yeah. name. I don't. Know. Awesome. Uh, one last question for you guys: uh, If you guys had to uh, invite any one of the characters over for dinner, who are you inviting? What are you serving? Do you know, I think I would invite Sherlock because I think it would be fascinating seeing him with my other dinner guests, <laughs> yeah, actually. Yeah, that would be good, yeah. Uh, what would I serve? He wouldn't eat, though, would he? No, he wouldn't eat, really. He'd just sit, I'd, I'd invite Moriarty yeah. and it would just be me and him and we'd just drink into oblivion. <laughs> <laughs> awesome, guys. Thank you so much. I really do appreciate it. Thank you so Have much. Have a good one.